there's my change and we are done grandpa can i ask you a question sure son how do you figure out how much change you get back after shopping oh that's simple we use subtraction can you explain what it means sure subtraction is the process of removing one number from another or calculating difference between two numbers for example let's say we have eight currency bills and we spend 3 what we are left with are five currency bills the subtraction expression is read as 8 minus 3 which means to remove 3 from 8 Here's how this very problem is solved on a number line. We locate 8 on the line, the number we want to remove from. We move 3 spaces to the left as we are subtracting. Remember, in addition, we move to the right. So subtraction is opposite of addition. Now we are at the number 5, which is the answer. So 8 minus 3 is 5. You have to remember that in subtraction the order of numbers is very important. Taking the same example there is a certain way 8 minus 3 is to be written. You place the bigger number at the top and the number to be reduced at the bottom. The answer of course is 5 as we saw earlier. However if we interchange the order of writing these numbers the answer doesn't hold true The answer for 3 minus 8 as a matter of fact is minus 5 But grandpa how do we remove 8 from 3 Isn't that impossible Good question Let's check this out on number line We locate three, the number we need to remove from. We go eight spaces to the left, and we get the answer as minus five. But is there a real world situation to describe this? Suppose there are very chilly conditions, and the temperature is at three degrees. With a snowstorm coming, the temperature drops by eight degrees to minus five. Now son let's look at another simple example of subtraction this time with two digit numbers say 47 minus 32 which is to check what remains after we remove 32 from the number 47 we start at the ones place here we have 7 minus 2 which means to remove 2 from 7 the answer for the ones place is 5 Now we move to the tens place where we have to remove 3 from 4. The answer of course is 1. So the answer of 47 minus 32 is 15. Grandpa, can you describe where in our day to day life is a fraction used? Sure son. Basically there are three different types of situations in real life where we frequently use subtraction. Let's look at them. Firstly, subtraction is used when we have to identify a part from a whole. Say 47 students in a class. 32 of them are boys. How many are girls? As we calculated before, the answer is 15 girls. Another situation where subtraction is used is when we have to reduce or decrease something. For example, we give away 32 apples from 47 apples. What remains with us? We use subtraction to find out the answer, which is 15 apples. Lastly, when we have to compare two numbers or have to match up one number to another, we use subtraction. For instance, Say Roy delivers 47 pizzas 
and John delivers 32. How many more pizzas did Roy deliver? We have seen what 47 minus 32 is. So the answer is 15 pizzas. Wow, Grandpa, that was super. Do you promise you will let me calculate how much change we have to give back to the taxi driver? Yes, 